<laughs> it's so strange how you can meet people sometimes, just out of nowhere, through complete coincidence. Now, I'm not a very superstitious person, but sometimes I can't help but wonder, does everything truly happen for a reason? Take this woman I work with, for example, met the love of her life through complete coincidence. It was really romantic, and it sure as hell wasn't on a street corner. So, in addition to having to listen to her talk all day about her new boo at work, the two of us were selected to work together for this charity auction. It was a really far ways away, so we decided to carpool together. But of course, she decided to drop out at the last minute to spend time with her new boy toy instead. So guess who had to drive themselves? I guess that's what happens when you miss a day of work to follow up on your rabies treatment. You come back and, oh, by the way, you're on the committee. So anyway, I'm driving far into the woods to the house of the chairman of the board to give him the check for the charity auction. And I was pretty excited because I'd never met him before. But once I got there, I was even more excited to get to know his son, Logan. Turn right onto a street. Stupid bank, James Bond lady. What street? There's a lot of streets. Oh. Hey there. Hi, I, um, I, I'm here to drop this off. It's for the charity auction. Okay, yeah, that's for my dad. Oh, he's your dad? <laughs> Unfortunately. <sighs> I love your Mini Cooper. Oh, yeah, thanks. I love that it's so small, so it's really good on gas, and it's actually a lot bigger inside than people think. Yeah, well, you know, sometimes the uh, biggest things come in the smallest packages. <laughs> it's really peaceful here. Oh, thanks. Yeah, we got uh, horses out back, presented at local shows. You want to come take a look? Um, well, I'd love to, but I, I have to get back to work. All right, well, uh, what are you doing this Friday? Hey, I come bearing gifts. Oh, thank you. Come on in. I got you these chocolates. They're Belgian. Uh, I'm really excited to try them. I don't know what their secret is, but they somehow pack a ton of punch into such a little, little bite. Oh, thank you. And I know that you said you liked horses, so I got you one of these. Uh, it's almost life size. Oh, thank you so much. What a cute dog! Oh, oh that would bark for a little lungs. I know. Just hold on one sec. All right, let's go. Okay. Thanks again for the chocolates. No problem. About the little things in life. Sometimes the best things come in the smallest packages. Yeah, I guess. Again, did we enjoy our dinners tonight? 
Yeah. Yeah, very much. Great. Let me get these out of the way for you. Would you like some dessert tonight? Oh God, I don't know. They all look so good. <laughs> uh, do you guys have that little like, sampler with all the small little desserts? Yes. You want to share that? Yeah, sure. Great. I will be right back. You know, Logan, I just want to say I'm having a really good time tonight. Me too. It's really nice to meet such a sincere gentleman. Oh. Well, you must have guys crawling all over you. Oh my god. I, seriously, it's just this one guy... You know what? Never mind. Tell me. N no, I think it's kind of rude to talk about a guy I dated with someone I'm dating right now. I don't care. Go for it. Okay, um... Well, this guy, we were out, and he basically publicly made fun of my chest size. It was in front of a crowd of people. I was really embarrassed. We well, you know what they say. Bigger isn't always better. Yeah. Welcome to our prize winning stables. First I'm going to show you Goliath. Well, sounds great. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, just be careful because these horses are skittish so any sudden movements, they get really scared. Okay. So. Oh, uh, yeah, remember put it there, just my horse so sneaky. Here he is. Oh. Yeah, he's a, uh, a mini horse. Oh, this is a mini horse farm. Yeah, it's the only one in the county. Oh, well, cool. He's really cute. Why do you call him Goliath? Well, as you may notice, he's small in stature, but what he lacks in size, he makes up in other ways. Oh. Yeah, you know, sometimes the biggest thing is don't carry the hardest punch. Yeah, totally. But it works on the reverse end as well. What do you mean? Like for us, you know, Christmas time, you see the biggest package. It's never, never the best thing. Sometimes the smallest uh, is the most fun. Uh, so where are the other horses? Come on, I'll show you. Wow, it's really beautiful out here. Yeah, we're proud to call it our own. I don't see any of the other horses, though. Uh, a lot of times they'll actually graze on the other side of the pasture there. Ooh, we're going to take this, but when I get back, we'll walk over there and check it out. All right, sounds good. Welcome back to your slogan. Logan! Logan!
Just put the gold bond right on the rash right in there. Okay. Love you too, Mom. Bye. Sarah, don't move. What? Don't move. I can't hear you. Yep, little things can definitely leave you in a lot of pain with maximum bruising. Don't get me wrong, little things can be cute and endearing, but sometimes a girl just needs a big package. <laughs>